Welcome to the next Meeples and Milkshakes Board Game Cafe unboxing video. The rest of our order arrived from Asmodee, excitedly. Here it is, six boxes. Let's see what we have. Ah, this is our Timeline Canada Blister Pack. There are six copies of Timeline in here. It's a fun uh, fun little game where you're trying to uh, arrange world events in the right chronological order. There are pictures of them on the cards. It's a lot of fun. Super easy to learn and play. Box number two. of Marvel Champions, the excellent new cooperative living card game from Fantasy Flight Games, one to four players, lots of fun. This box actually, we opened our store copy. The box has a beautiful card in uh, box insert with uh, dividers for cards. So unlike previous card games where you had to come up with your own storage solution, they wised up and put it right in the box. It's a good sign if you're a LCG fan. They're listening to their customers and trying to make things better for, for everybody. Ah, well, there's the other copy we were expecting. Have some Ms. Marvel hero packs for Marvel Champions. Apparently these are kind of difficult to find. Got some in. Green Goblin scenario pack. Here it is. So the, the game comes with some scenarios, but uh, when you've had enough of those and you want to try something else, there's a more, more stories in here. And these are more cards that you would put in your player decks. Here we have our first Keyforge. So Worlds Collide, two-player starter set. This comes with two um, unique decks, playmats, tokens, rules, yeah, it's a great fun game. There's also the premium box, which you can tell from the side here, contains a box that can hold your cards and your tokens. It also has a premium chain tracker, which will make more sense once you learn the game. This is a really good value. Actually, I think there's also two decks in this box. Is there? Maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong. Nope, it does. It includes two unique Worlds Collide Archon decks. So there's two decks in here as well. Somebody ordered this Star Wars Legion expansion, Scout Troopers unit. Bunch of uh, Scout Troopers there. Pieces. Very cool. Two copies of Jaipur. Two-player game from Space Cowboys. It's a very fun card game. Very good game. Now available. go animal upon animal my very first games that explains i had a question why is the other version of animal upon animal twice as much well here's the original version and there's the other version so i think that might help explain why why it's more expensive bigger pieces those look cute great children's game another great kids game rhino hero super battle in this game, you have these cards and you stack them up and you're trying to uh, situate the cards such that on, in, on other players' turns, they accidentally make the tower topple. This game is crazy fun. Wow. Black Angel. Here it is. This is a heavy game in more ways than one from the maker of Trois. Artwork by Ian O'Toole, who is one of the best artists in the board game industry there it is black angel excited to have that in the store there's a couple more copies of timeline you can see them out of the out of the blister pack 
when did this happen? There you go, a couple more of those. Also, a 12, 12 uh, Archon decks, 12 Keyforge decks, Worlds Collide. There they are. These are going to be sold separately, not as a complete box. Once I get more, if somebody wants a complete box, I can sell them as a complete box. But these ones will be online separately. There's an X-Wing Hyena class droid bomber. This is already spoken for as well. Very cool. They do a great job painting these. And another kid's game, My First Carcassonne. The simplified version of Carcassonne, which was actually the first uh, modern board game that our family played way back when. And uh, they made a kid's version. There it is. I'd like to take a second to shout out and thank you to everybody who's been placing orders on our website already when, since we launched. It's exciting to see things happening now and uh, we hope to keep bringing more and more great products in that you like. Here's more kids games. We know a lot of you have uh, kids at home that are bored and you need some way to keep them entertained. So here's some more kids game, another copy of Animal Upon Animal. Two, two more very first games, Flower Fairy and First Orchard, ages two and up. Some colorful pieces there, safe for, safe for little kids. This game is growing in popularity and esteem, Res Arcana, designed by Tom Lehman. This is a card game typically played with two players, but does support up to four. I've played it at two and three players. It's uh, not very hard to learn, actually, and a lot of fun. Pretty deep strategy in this game. And, uh, yeah, art is great, too. One more Star Wars Legion, Jin Erso, Commander Expansion. There's a mini in there, some cards, a token. I'll never get used to seeing Disney next to Star Wars, but there it is. Encore. This is one of my favorite new games of the last year. This is a two to four player game. It plays equally well at all of those player counts. Very easy to learn. It's like a, it's a very similar game to Splendor, if you've heard of Splendor. Uh, very simple on your turn. You can take some of these uh, little poker chips, which you can use to spend on these tiles, which you want to arrange in a good way to score points. It takes almost no time to learn and the games themselves last maybe 20 minutes. Very excited to have that. Up here now a bunch of uh, a bunch of more Marvel Champions packs have another Green Goblin scenario pack Thor hero pack another Ms. Marvel and another Thor there we go there's other hero packs they're currently out of stock and uh, we, we have placed an order for them. We'll get them when they're back in stock at the supplier. Last box, box number six for this order. We're expecting more products to arrive tomorrow. So we'll do another video when those arrive. Oh, another Green Goblin scenario pack. And another two Captain America packs. Here's the original version of Rhino Hero, a smaller, simpler version of the game. You can see there the cards. You actually bend those cards. They come in flat, but they've got little fold regions, and you're supposed to fold them. And sometimes it feels a little bit strange to purposely bend the cards, but that's what you do in this game. You bend the cards, and you stack them up, and try to make the highest uh, stack you can. I mean, it's a kid's game, but adults will enjoy that game, too. This one's been hard to get for a while, but it's finally back in stock. When I say hard to get, I mean hard to get elsewhere. We're brand new, but this is the first time we've had it. Camel Up. We have the original edition of this game, but this is the second edition. Nicer components. Better artwork, although I did like the components and the artwork in the original. 
This is a two to eight player, or did they make it higher? No, eight player. Uh, three to eight player, actually, sorry. Three to eight player game for ages eight and up. It takes about half an hour. It's actually a hilarious game. Usually there's a lot of laughing and, and, uh, and yelling during this game. It's actually a race game, but you're racing camels, but you are not the camels. You are the spectators watching the camels and betting on them. And so you're trying to uh, bet on the best camels to get the best payoff. And it is a lot of fun. This was actually the Spiel de Jahr winner a few years ago. Spiel de Jahr is the most prestigious award given in the board gaming world from uh, in Germany. They're the best game of the year and they generally uh, focus on family games in that category. Carcassonne, classic now a classic, uh, one of the early modern uh, winners in the in board games. Carcassonne, very easy to play game. Games take about half an hour, plays up to five. This is the new version of the game that includes the river expansion and the abbot. This is a lot of fun. We have played this game hundreds, literally hundreds of times, and I don't think I'll ever get sick of playing Carcassonne. So there we go. That is all the new things in today's uh, shipment. We'll have uh, more tomorrow. All of this is available for purchase on meeples.ca. If you're in Penticton, you'll be able to pick up uh, curbside at our location on Westminster Avenue. Or if you're in Penticton, we can deliver to you. That also is available. And if you're not in Penticton, we can ship to you on Canada, with Canada Post. And we have uh, flat rates for shipping and free shipping uh, over certain thresholds, depending on where in the province in the country you are. All of that information and more is available at meeples.ca. Thanks very much for watching this video. Please like to this video and subscribe to our channel. Hit that bell so that you get notifications when we post more videos. And we'll keep uh, making these as we get more products. And we'll also start making videos about other things having to do with the Board Game Cafe and our business. And we look forward to tell, uh, talking more about that as well as uh, planning on making some uh, videos about individual games that we want to talk about and, and uh, share with you. So thanks again. Bye for now.